All right, my name is Lance Valentine with Louisiana Generators. Um, I'm going to demonstrate a whole home surge suppressor and the benefits of having a whole home surge suppressor. What a whole home surge suppressor does is it you tie it into your main electrical system, and it protects everything from this come from your anything in your home. So anything that's tied downstream of this, so any of your appliances, any of your TVs, anything in your home, your air conditioning system, it'll take the voltage and the voltage goes up for a few seconds and comes down. Well, sensitive electronics can't handle that at all. So what that does is once it goes up like that and it exceeds the maximum limit of voltage in there, it shorts out the control boards inside these. It could be a DVR, it could be the uh, LED TVs. It, the surge is gonna get assumed by this. Well, so once it hits a surge, there's a buzzer that will go off. It'll go off and it, you'll hear it and it, it takes the surge so the surge suppressor at that point is no good anymore but it took the hit and not anything in your home of any of your expensive appliances the surge suppressor that we use we have one manufactured directly for a whole home that will take care of your whole house or if you have a generator at your house we have one specifically designed for a transfer switch that'll take care of your whole home plus your generator system so if it does take a lightning strike or any kind of power surge and it burns a surge suppressor up when it's protecting your home, we will come, we will replace this part for no charge for the lifetime of your home. So if you're the original homeowner, you only have to buy this one time. If it does take the hit to the part, the surge suppressor itself will be for free. You'll have to pay the labor just to change it, which is pretty uh, minimal. So I'm gonna demonstrate how it works. We're basically gonna install it in a 200 amp main electrical panel for a home and I'll show you how it hooks up and how it actually protects your home. It can be mounted outside in the weather or it can be mounted inside in an interior closet or an interior panel out of the weather. If you have an outdoor panel I always recommend mounting it outside the panel that way because if you're walking by it or something you can see if it it's buzzing or if all your lights are, are working on it. One is telling you that hey everything is good the other light if it's on is going to tell you hey we got a problem. So at that point, you need to call a service professional to come out and inspect it. All we would do on an outdoor panel is we come in, we drill a half inch hole into the panel. We run the wiring through the panel. Basically what we do here, we take and um, we install a breaker inside the main panel here, 200 amp panel. We tie, um, we tie the 240 volts as the main incoming power comes in and it takes care of uh, the whole bus bar of the incoming power from your utility company. So anything from the load side of the meter, which is what powers your house. Uh, so everything in this panel is protected from any kind of uh, lightning strike or power surge. You'll see the pan this here is mounted on the outside of your unit right here we would turn this breaker on you see up here that uh, everything is okay we're running fine um, if any kind of problems what would happen when this buzzer goes off these lights are, instead of being green like they are right now telling us everything is okay those lights would turn red and saying and and actually you would have a buzzer coming out here a noise as time goes on, that buzzer gets weaker and weaker, but at the when the first 24 hours, it's very audible. So anytime you come out here and you look at this right here, you don't want to see, and you don't see green lights on it, you know you got a problem. So just walk by once every now and then. If you do, just happen to look up, make sure the green lights are still on it. So anyway, and as of right now, this whole house is protected, and they don't have anything to worry about of any kind of power surges from utilities.